Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm going to give you a tour of our balcony room on board Royal Caribbean's Spectrum of the Seas. Okay guys, so they've just cleared us to enter our rooms. So we are here in room 8318. Uh, and we have a balcony room as I mentioned. So let's go ahead and pop into the bathroom because that's the first door you run into here. And as always, don't forget there is a lip down here a step so you got to make sure you step out don't kill yourself in the middle of the night this is a fairly new ship and you can tell that by looking at all the finishings and all the stuff this is a really nice shower it's got the curved door which i love hop in there so you can see at the bottom there's an echo if i'm inside the shower you can see at the bottom there's a foot rest can use that for shaving your legs ladies or if you need to set something then there's a little shelf your hair and body wash removable shower head and then you adjust your temperature with one side and you turn on and off with the other side you could turn the t you can turn the the water on and off there and then you've got your commode here and as always remember not to flush a bunch of junk in there a nice little sink and there is a nice uh, shelf here for setting your toiletry bags as well as shelves here and you've got these little lips here to keep stuff from sliding should you run into rough waters and then there is an outlet here for shavers if you need them and it looks like you can use either the rounded or the flat so US or European um, plugs right there so that's nice plenty of towels in there so that's the bathroom that's nice and then let's take a look at when you come out from the bathroom you've got a closet right here and as you can see we've got our bags in here but there's shell uh, hooks here you can hang stuff here look at how many hangers there are in here like you could move in here <laughs> Ooh, that's that much stuff um and then you've got a stopper here so that the door doesn't bang into there then this is the bed area you have two nightstand areas so the nightstand areas you've got two shelves here and then you've got an outlet on one side with an uh all room switch there and then these are controlled individually so you could turn it on and off with that switch and then you've got a nice we've got a king size bed that we are sharing now one thing i want you to notice how much storage is in here i already showed you the one closet with all those hangers but look at this you've got one over each bed for storage which is amazing then we've got a uh, TV is right across from the bed here and there is a little shelf in here if you want to stick anything in there for storage and the TV looks like a Samsung so it looks like a nice television if you want to watch TV. On this side there is no outlet on one side of the bed. There's only out outlet on one side and the light switch so you can't control both on both sides but I'll show you where else you can charge stuff. This closet is built a little bit differently so you've got your little locker here you're safe and you've got shelves here and then this is thin you can hang like a dress or a suit and things like that and then here you've got a couple of drawers down here as well where you can store stuff so that's nice and then over here is your desk area or vanity you could use as just slide your seat out and slide in if you want to sit here and work on something or if you want to use it like I said as a vanity it's got this nice light that will help you to do your makeup uh, then you've got two outlets here um, and again these are look to be like the US outlets not the UK so make sure you keep that in mind now there are two USB ports so that's perfect if you're charging like a phone or things that mo many things now you can charge through USB there's also a 220 here you can use an adapter for either one just make sure that it's a dual voltage if you're going to use that you got little shelves here we've got complimentary water to start with and then we have a nice little coffee bar you've got your kettle here your mugs feels like ooh, real real silverware in there if we need that and then look at this more storage again so we've got a little refrigerator here where we could keep things cool and then We've got all of these drawers, look at that, a hair dryer, and all kinds of stuff, all that space, tons of space. As I said, there's a ton of storage. Okay, uh, and then we've got this uh, couch here as well. Um, you know, I'm not sure that this pulls out. Doesn't look like it. 
So I guess if somebody was in here, they could just lay on there. I don't know how that would work, but this is a pretty good sized room. But of course the highlight of it is the balcony. So we'll take a look at that. Look at how nice this is. So it's one door and it looks almost like a portal door, which is kind of cool. Um, it does have a child lock up here if you're in the room with a little person and you want to keep them safe, then you would use the child lock. But since we have no children with us, we don't need it. So we're going to open it up and walk out here. Look at how beautiful this is. This is great because these are adjustable. You can move it back some or sit up tall. And then you also have foot rest as well, which is nice if you got a little table. So you could sit out here and put your feet up. That means you don't have to put your feet here to put your feet up. You've got two chairs, two foot rest, and your table right here. And check out this view. One of the things I love about a ship is some of the technology you get on it. And this uh, Spectrum of the Seas has pretty good technology. So I'm going to show you this remote they have right here. This is just inside the app. With it, one thing you can do is control the TV. Let's just hit the little power button and it should turn right on. There it is. So you've got that. You can change the channels and all that. But another thing I really like about the app is that you can use it as your key. Now I've tried this on other ships that said it would work and it's never actually worked. So let's go try it out now and see if this works. You just have to have your app open, put it to the door and it should open the door for you. Okay, so you just have to have the app open. Did not work. It did work before. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it didn't work once again. Now I did try it last <laughs> night and it did work. So it didn't work today. I'm glad I had my key with me though. So it's kind of cool, but I wouldn't leave the room without the key, just in case it doesn't work. So we got a great deal on this cruise. It's a short one. It is a four days and three nights. So um, it's a short cruise, but we're gonna get just enough time to have a good time here. <laughs> but I think this is a really good sized room. I don't know about you guys, but um, as far as a balcony room, this room here is it's really quite good, I think. Um, so we paid under $300 for two of us for this cruise. Unbelievable. Um, that's a really good deal. <laughs> uh, so I would suggest going on and checking out the prices. Definitely want to um, look at the cruises out of Singapore if you're in uh, the Southeast Asia area it's an easy place to get to we did come here from Bangkok two and a half hour flight again the flight was fairly inexpensive to boot so really when you put all those costs together um, you know it's it comes out to fairly inexpensive to come in visit Singapore and do the cruise now you could just come in um, and do the cruise but if you're here, you might as well take a couple extra days and check out the city. So again, hope you guys have enjoyed this video and guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We got lots more cool stuff coming up. Um, this cruise that we're on here is going over to Malaysia. We're stopping off in uh, Kuala Lumpur, well, a port to Kuala Lumpur, as well as uh, Penang in Malaysia as well before coming back to Singapore and then we'll fly to Thailand out of here. So uh, hopefully you guys are subscribing. Turn on that notification bell for when we have more new videos. Give me a like. Leave me a comment if you've tried the spectrum of the seas before.